So, hi guys! It's been a while. Um, I've actually been quite busy with, like, well, stuff. Um, I actually started school, like, a few weeks ago, and, um, well, it's been quite eventful. Um, I had to change my schedule, like, a bunch of times, because, well, um, since I'm retaking my second high school year, um, I'm taking all the courses or classes that I dropped uh, last year and that I didn't take in the first year, um, which basically means I only have like one or two classes with my actual classmates. Uh, so I had to fix it all together and yet I had to take away one course because, well, I can't deal with it, I have to take a test instead, but that's when I'm ready. So I actually finally got the perfect schedule and um, I'm happy with it. So hopefully that means I can study the way I want to and do good in school because that's important to me. Anyhow, I have done quite a lot of things outside school as well. I've been working my ass off to earn some money. Um, because I need to get some really not so cheap stuff uh, and um, well I've been planning some trips like to Sebastian for example and um, actually a trip abroad next year I will do a separate with a separate separate video about that sorry English is hard but anyway um, so I've been busy and I've been sick as well I I went to PepCon, the convention in Uppsala, and I'm very sorry that Emily couldn't show up. I'm sorry for my sake, I'm sorry for your sake and hers, but her passport didn't arrive in time, and we're all very sorry about that. But there are plans to have her come in next year instead, and hopefully she will be visiting, like, maybe... I don't know, during spring or whatever. We're gonna try having her here sometime anyway. PepCon was good. I was a bit stressed because I was attending two panels. I had to sell a lot of stuff. I had to be on stage and I had to do well, a lot of stuff and take care of people. And I enjoy all of it, but I was stupid enough to go when I felt that I was catching a cold and the cold just kept getting worse and in the end, at Sunday, I actually lost my voice for a while. Um, and uh, it was horrible because I'm a very talkative person and uh, I need to speak. Because I like speaking. Um, but I managed to do the free panel as Nagisa and I think it was a success. It was even no, it wasn't better than the last one, but it was equally good because everyone laughed a lot and we had a lot of fun and the other actors and cosplayers that was in the panel was amazing. And the audience was really great as well, except that they were really quiet and only a few people dared to ask questions over and over again. And I liked one person in particular, because she was asking a lot, a lot, a lot of very interesting questions, especially to me as Nagisa, that included the Thuggisa side. <laughs> and I was wearing my Thuggy, Thug Steamy shirt, and um, since I got a cold, I had my mouth mask, and Rei-chan was giving me his scarf, and it was really fun. Um, well, anyway, um... I sold a lot of stuff, so I could afford paying some tickets to Sebastian, since I have been, well, I haven't been at his place since earlier this summer, so I'm going there during Halloween, and that's gonna be fun. Uh, he's coming here actually in three weeks, two weeks, whatever, uh, I, well, like, almost three weeks, because we're actually going to celebrate our first anniversary together. And I'm very excited about that. Uh, we've been apart for two weeks already, almost. And I feel sad about that because, well, I feel complete when he's with me. So, yeah. Uh, um, and today, 
something very funny happened. Uh, actually, I, I've talked to a company for a while uh, since there's plans on doing a documentary about me and stuff. So, the company that wants to do the documentary also wants to help me with my YouTube channel. So, they have talked to another company, uh, like YouTube partnership company. So, today I actually signed a contract about that and I'm really excited to start working with them and uh, it means a lot to me that I can do something that I love and actually have it kind of as a job even if it isn't the high paid job like I can live on this but it's still one step closer for me to get to the like entertainment business and that's my dream right now maybe changes in the future but right now that's what I want so this is mostly a rambling blog but you might insert some clips from stuff like I went to the Harry Potter exhibition a few weeks ago with my foster siblings and that was great and to see the stuff that was in the movies it was just like oh my god can I cry now and I've been dreaming about that for a long time so yeah, if it's going somewhere where you live, I really recommend you to go to the Harry Potter exhibition because it's lovely and you get this really like goosebumps when you go in there and I almost cried a few times because childhood feels. Well, I guess that was it for now. I'm planning a bunch of new videos coming, like a few makeup videos, like Kuroko no Basuke makeup videos. Uh, do -da -da -da. and more Kurushitsui specific characters will come soon but uh, yeah I also have a few new cosplay plans so I will probably cost test them soon for example Isumi Sina from uh, Love Stage yeah the new really cute sugar sweet anime jowy thingy and um, kind of be make Sebastian be Ryoma and uh, yeah, I'm also going to be doing Mikasa Ai from Utano Prince Sama season 2 with my friend Natalie and her sister Annie and uh, Mika because we're going to do a dance group and there are going to be Kamu and um, gosh, what's their names? I'm blank. Yeah, but the other guys, <laughs> they're hot. But Mikasa is my favorite. I Oh well. Um, so I'm looking forward to share all of my new videos with you guys and I hope you stay excited for them and um, yeah, I hope to see you guys soon. Bye. <laughs> no, no, that was my stick. That's really rude. Oh, they're sharing the same stick before they fight each other to death. Yeah, that's right. You're the boss. Don't let a kid ruin your playtime. <laughs>